Howdy, howdy, my name is Good Guy Michael on my YouTube channel. Welcome to more Defending the Realm. So it's been a little while, and welcome back, guys. So today we have a lot on our plate. Last time we were here, we made an army to fight the Crimson Colt, and although we are not quite ready to fight the Crimson Colt, we're gonna start keep improving our army. But we're gonna get ourselves some mounts and stuff like that. But first thing we need to do is we need to upgrade the Great Board. Okay, so this board here is a little bit past uh has not been kept up to date so there is move animals into the farm we totally did that we did that like nobody's business okay next put town uh town all in the barn i'm pretty sure that's supposed to say town hall which we totally did okay um make a priest oh shoot we so have not made a priest yet and check this out deathless we have like three NPCs in here, so we'll get an extra soldier, and then we'll get the soldier that died in there, remember when we were training, so yeah, if we make a town, if we make a priest, we're gonna get so many extra NPCs, actually, okay, so make a priest, we need to do that, get black lava rock, that was obsidian, and we got that, and made the nether portal, build the portal to the nether, we also did that, okay, armor or some shit, I don't know, perfect, so we did that as well, so now let's update our signs, so the, what I want to do, is I want to build build a guard uh, guard station next to the nether portal so we will do that um, then we, we want to build a farm for oh, whoops there we go farm for choke for Choco bow and that's what we're gonna do uh, next is we're gonna build a chocobo farm in this episode So we're gonna need to start farming guy Sala Seeds and that'll be part of the part of the chocobo farm and then we want to tame our first uh, Or first oh shoot we want to um golden lasso which uh, we should have all the stuff for uh, it's golden lasso well so we will need a golden lasso and then we'll want to tame all the choco bow ever <laughs> there we go ever perfect so there's our there's our goals for this build a guard station next to the nether portal perfect build a farm uh, for chocobo farming guy saw seeds golden lasso uh, make a priest, which uh, we'll do sometime eventually, <laughs> and tame all the chocobos ever. Okay, but first, we're going to go ahead and we're going to build ourselves a fort. Now, as you can see over at the uh, at the nether station, I actually tried this before. What are you doing out of here? Get out of here. Okay, so, I actually built one, be or I started to build one, and I built it out of like this white marble and black basalt stone, but uh, it it looks really tacky and gaudy in comparison with uh, with the normal stuff. So I'm gonna build like a guard station like right over here that's gonna stand guard over the nether station. Okay, so without further to do, let's get into it. All right, guys, you know what time it is, and it is time for another building. Now, it has been a while since I've made a building on the series, and to be perfectly honest, I felt a little bit rusty. Now, as you see right there, what happened was that a handful of my guards actually ran into the nether for some weird reason. I'm unsure why, but we'll have to deal with that once we're done with this building. Now, as you guys have seen my series before know, I like to start every structure with a bone structure. Now, this is going to be a structure where we're going to have the soldiers be and the, eventually a commander and like a medic so I wanted there to be a hierarchy feel so I built the bottom part where this is it's gonna be the dorms for the soldiers and that top square that you see there is eventually actually going to be a area for a commander and we're gonna fill that out with deco craft which is a really cool mod that gives you some awesome things so you can have signs and really nice tables things that you can't have in normal minecraft as you can see i'm just building that up again just the bone structure on top it's gonna be pretty small it's gonna be like an office eventually but uh for now we're just gonna go keep it with the theme of the rest of the area i thought about using some other blocks such as like actual cobblestone brick but decided against it so just gonna go keep with our normal cobblestone and add a little bit of decoration now as you can see here I'm gonna actually start working on the bottom part those two front spots are gonna be the stairs that allow you to walk up to the top part because we don't want to have to punch a hole through the bottom of the uh, of the officers room 
And uh, this spot down here is going to open up for the dormitories, and it's going to be a pretty open area. I'm actually going to keep that gravel in there for the floor of the dormitory area, because I thought it gave it a pretty good rugged feel to it, and we want our soldiers to be rugged and tough, as, you know, you want soldiers to be. So. Here we go, we're filling that in with some gravel, and then we're going to actually start decorating it in a second, but we need to fix those dirt on the walls. We want to have some nice continuity, and the dirt just looks trashy and doesn't look strong. Okay, so we decorate in the ceiling, and here pretty soon, I'm going to start putting in some beds. I blocked those off because they kind of looked a little weird. I thought about using them maybe for a storage area, but eventually decided to hold them off, and I left torches in there so we won't spawn uh, monsters in there and mess with our soldiers. Okay, as you can see, this is our final final build all preppy and done with all of our decorations on there I used buttons for accents both wood and stone because I think that they add a little bit to the different flat surfaces and break it up and make it look very nice all overall I am very happy with how this turned out All right, guys, so as you can see, our little guard base is done in this bot. The idea behind it was that in this bottom part, we're going to have the uh, the guys, this is where they sleep. And then in the top part is eventually we're going to use deco craft to uh, craft like a desk and stuff because that's going to be like the commander's room and that's a little perch. But uh, for now, I don't know if you guys saw in the time lapse, but uh, four of our soldiers, for some weird reason, decided to go wandering into the nether. So we need to, luckily, the nether, um, uh, like, the nether runs on a different time than us, so since we're not in there, it's technically not running at the moment. So we need to go in and grab and repack our soldiers and pack them out and then block off the nether before we start our choco farm. Um, hopefully they don't go walking immediately into the lava, otherwise I'm going to be very upset. Um, okay, repack. Oh god. Oh, what are you guys doing? Get out of here. What are you guys doing? Where are you going? Stop! Where are you going? Oh god! Where are they going? Okay, repack. Repack. What the fuck are these guys trying to get to? Oh, dear goodness. Okay, um, so... <laughs> what the hell are they looking at over here? I'm kind of curious now that they... I mean, they, they came running into the nether to kill whatever the hell's over here. It's probably just a pigman. It's lava. Good, you guys want to kill the lava. I'm, that's... You know what? It's not worth it for me. Okay, so... What I, uh... Now what we want need to do... Yo, fuck it, we're just, we're getting out, we're getting out. Okay, so, now, before, uh, before we start crafting our choco farm, um, I wanted to, let's screw this, we don't need this, and that Midasium. Actually, that's, um, something that's gonna be a little bit helpful, so, for starters, let's block off the nether, <laughs> the, the nether, so that our guys do not go running in there again. Um, let's see, is that enough? Uh, we'll put cobble on the back. So this, this will make it so that only we can get into the nether. Um, these guys can try and try as they might, but they're not going to get in the into the nether. Let's put them back down. Goodness, I can't believe they just ran off like that. Okay. Um, unpack, unpack, and then... That's so bizarre, I've never seen them do that before. Okay, so, now we have our soldiers. Um, uh, let's, uh, let's go. We want to... I swear to goodness, you guys are going to be the death of me. Repack, place you here. Repack, put you over here as well. Re, re guard Dwayne, repack, put you over here. And I get the weird feeling that Bobby is dead since Dwayne is all by himself. Okay, um, so, Vulcanite, because we need, we need blaze rods so we, so we can make blaze powder. And Vulcanite is a, uh, is an ether ore that I managed to find one brick of, which is honestly all we need, that, um, is used to make uh, that we can use to make blaze, blaze stuff. As you can see up here, see blaze rod? If we click on this, vulcanite ingots, two vulcanite ingots makes one blaze rod. And as you guys know, blaze rods make blaze powder. At least, yeah, see, make two blaze powder. Because we need to make a golden lasso. And golden lassos are made by, um, golden lasso, an eye of ender, uh, four string, four gold, and an eye of ender is a blaze blaze powder and an ender eye or an ender pearl which we have right here ender pearl uh four gold nuggets one two three four awesome let's go we'll go collect some string while we're waiting for that vulcanite to smelt down 
Oh, look at all that wheat. Oh, look at all this. Look at all this cotton. Oh, King Cotton over here. I'm gonna be rich. I'm gonna have to start a plantation. Start work on my southern draw. All right. Um. Ah, oh, now, nah, ha. Huh. I got this cotton yard, and it's, uh, that's not a southern draw. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, so let's get this uh, get this lasso up and running. Okay, it's gonna take four string. We have more than enough for four string, like that. Look at that. Four, five, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve string. Goodness, we got more than enough. Okay, so now our vulcanite should be done. Put that to the bottom. And we want to make two Vulcanite b bars. Oh, whew. <laughs> it glitched out for a second, and I thought something weird was going to happen. Okay, that's all of our Vulcanite, but that's all we need. All we need is one. Perfect. Okay, so now we go put this. That's not what I wanted. We put it in here. That gives us a Blaze Rod. Put this in here. That gives us Blaze Powder. Put this in here. This gives us an Eye of Ender. Put this in here. Uh, and it goes one, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. Perfect. Golden lasso. And this, oh man, this. You guys have no clue how useful this is. This is going to be the um, such an amazing tool for us. This is going to allow us to farm or get our chocobos and stuff like that. Because I'll show you what it does here in one second. Um, a gas here. Okay, so we put those nether ores in there. Perfect. So let's go find an animal that's out of their out of their pen. Okay, and I'll show you what the uh, what this does. So down here, see we have this cow that's not in its pen, right? Whoosh, and whoosh, look at that! Oh, look at that! Pig is not in his right pen, and we can go whoosh, and we'll put it over here like this. Whoosh, perfect! Look at that! How cool is that? Oh my gosh! You guys are you guys are killing me! You're literally killing me! Okay, Oof. and. Repack. <laughs> Stop! Just do your goddamn jobs! Okay, so let's, um, I hope they're not trying, they're tr probably trying to go to the other one as their home, huh? Um, repack, okay. And then we place you over here. This is your home. This is where you get food. Do you guys have food in here? I hope so. Let's see. Speaking of food, oh man, look at that. They need, they need carrots, so let's go over to the carrot farm. Hopefully they've been doing their job. Well, I guess we'll find out in one second. Holy shit, they're doing their job. Oh my goodness, I had no clue. Holy cow. Wow, well, good job. Sorry for ever doubting. Holy shit, I'm sorry for ever doubting you guys. Damn. So these guys are better farmers than I thought they were, to be perfectly honest. Wow. Okay, so resources. Resources. Good. So this is going to start breeding pigs like nobody's business. This is going to start um, breeding cows like nobody's... What the hell is this? Minoki, Minoki, essence, something like that, and then um, we're actually gonna need to put some seeds in. Well, there's some Minoki essence in there too, huh? Something must have exploded and um, dropped Minoki essence, or Minoki essence is just something that randomly drops from animals. I'm unsure, but uh, something weird's going on. Okay, so let's go. We'll put these in the. Oh man, I need to eat. Is why I'm moving so slow. You guys are probably screaming at me from the other side of the fence. We actually um, we need to here in a little bit. Uh, Go and uh, get some sheep, and we actually can get some sheep now with that golden lasso, which makes things so much easier. Okay, good, good, good. Now, we're gonna go, we want to, hmm, we're gonna put a chocobo farm. I kinda wanna put it up on top of the hill, kinda wanna put it here. But uh, for starters, we need to collect some Gaisalas. Now, Gaisalas are what we use to, um, to tame chocobos, and chocobos can take anywhere from um, one to four Gaisalas, I think is what it said on average. Um, so these guys sell us are what we need and we're actually gonna start farming them as well So we're gonna go go and collect a whole bunch of them. Wow this I didn't realize this this woods over here is so thick What are these pear cool pear this is me uh nutmeg ha huh. I could nutmeg <laughs> Okay, well can we eat raw nutmeg or does that have to be made into an ingredient where to go? Where did nutmeg at yo? I, I got that nutmeg. It's my nutmeg what? It's robbing me of my nutmeg. That's bogus, yo. Okay, so uh, let's go collect some more guys. Solas, and then we'll go on a quest for the mighty quest for the chocobos. The chocobo. Wow, we have a lot of guys. Solas over here, which means actually at one point there were a bunch of chocobos. Um, but uh, that uh, they what the hell? It's a bat. Get out of here, bat. 
Um, now, the reason why we want choke bows is because actually choke bows, if you breed them correctly, um, do cool things like, you know, a normal choke bow, nothing special, right? Nothing special! But, uh, when you... I wonder if I can get these guys to start planting Gaisala seeds, actually. Is that... I wonder... Let's try it. Um, so, we'll put... We'll turn some of these into... If we put these in here, are these gonna plant them? Maybe? We'll see. We'll see! Okay, oh, it's getting close tonight, so we're gonna need to sleep here soon. Um, but, uh, then, well, I'll bring us back in, and we'll build a chocobo farm. I think over... Over here? Like, where this hill is? So we'll have to do a little bit of terraforming. Oh man, I should collect these roses. These would look so good. Okay. Um, come on, sleep! Sleep, and then I can- then I can start the video. Sleep! Sleep, damn you! Alright, let's collect these real quick. Cause these are gonna look gorgeous. Ah, oh, there we go, finally, get some sleep. Okay, and bingo. Good, 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 so let's break these roses, we'll use those for decorations eventually. And then, um, oh, look at there's a, oh, I thought there's a chocobo over here. Is there a chocobo? Look at there's so many guys saw seeds though. Okay, anyways, I'll bring you guys back in, um, let's, uh, I'll find, I'll tear these down, and then we'll build ourselves a chocobo farm. Alright guys, so time to start building ourselves a little chocobo ranch. Now, what I'm building here is a little barn that not, that isn't going to hold actual chocobos, but is going to be an area where I can keep supplies, and it'll be a separation between the Gaisala farm and the actual chocobo ranch. Because I wanted to have an area that was a nice little central hub, and it felt a little bit separate, so because it serves a different purpose, but also blends in with the rest of the buildings. So as you can see here, I'm making the farm, and this is where we're going to start growing Growing all of our Gaisala greens. Uh, I've never actually used this mod before, so I am very excited. It seems like I've heard a lot of good things about it. I know that the Yogg's cast likes to use it, uh, especially Duncan, and so I am very excited to, for this mod. Now, as you see there, I left the door open too wide because chocobos need two wide doors to get through. Uh, we're going to use fence around the edges because apparently chocobos can suffocate in walls, um, and we're going to put the fence eventually too high. Now I didn't, I don't know a whole lot about chocobos, but it wouldn't surprise me if they could jump out of a fence that is one high, so we're just going to set it up a little bit higher, and then also that helps prevent anything bad from happening from them. Now over here you can see that I'm going to start pushing back this mountain, because I'm going to build the Love Shack. Alright, this is going to be an area where we're going to breed special chocobos optimistically. Now chocobos breed by themselves, but uh, you can give them special guy saws that make them fall in love, and then then you uh, combine different types of chocobos together, different colors for different abilities. Alright, so all overall, it's all finished up, and I think it looks pretty good. That little wooden hut over there is going to be a resting area, we're going to put some straw on the floor there, and some cauldrons so that they can get a sip whenever they're thirsty, but other than that, it's all done, and let's bring us back in. Alright guys, as you can see here, we finally have our little ranch! So, this is where the chocobos are gonna be. As you can see right here, we have ourselves a little bit of a farm. And, uh, I'll probably actually... Oh, did that just give me seeds? Did it give... Oh wait, did it? Oh, it gives me seeds and... Oh man! Oh, and that gave me a lovely, uh, Gaisala. Lovely Gaisalas increase your, uh, your chances of getting, like, um... Uh... Special, special chocobos. Which actually, if you guys notice, there's that, um... There's that special, like, weird building, um, that I was, I built towards the end of that, and that's gonna be the Love Shack, which is where the chocobos breed. Um, and by the way, those fences are double wide because chocobos have to go through double wide fences, and having a single wide allows me to get through. Okay, so, chocobos, however, have, um, need a few things. So they need, uh, a thing, so they need water for starters, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put cauldrons in here and fill them with water, and that'll allow the chocobo chocobos to drink, and then they need straw mats so they can sleep on them. So let's go and we'll make ourselves some of that. Um, cauldrons, of course, are just gonna take, I'm gonna throw these in here. Um, a lovely Gaisala. And you can also, there's there's pink Gaisalas and red Gaisalas, I believe. And they do different things. What are you doing out of that pen? Trying to escape. You don't get to escape. You live a life of slavery and eventually death. Okay, so, we're gonna need iron. Iron to make our, um, Iron to make, what are you doing out, oh, goodness, cows everywhere. Cows everywhere. The farmers are doing a terrible job keeping the cows in the pens. Okay, so, start with iron. Iron because I said so. Um, tin, iron, uh, that's steel, isn't it? Yep, so we do not want steel, we want 
nine. We're gonna need f at least, we'll probably need around four. So, um, four in here, and then like this. See, that's one, because we need four, um, four cauldrons for the different places. Okay, good. So we have four cauldrons. Now we're gonna need, uh, buckets to fill the, fill the cauldrons with water. Perfect. And then straw mat, which is just like this, and that's make straw, and that gives us, oh, look at that, eight. Oh, wow, holy cow, okay. That's <laughs> made a little bit more than I meant to. That's okay. Um, we'll put the button in here. <laughs> We're gonna have straw mats for days. We need to start crafting that into bread so we have bread for days. Or um, start making, uh, like, cakes or something. We need to start getting rid of all that bread that we have in here. Okay, so have they farmed? Do they far have they farmed the... It's... I can't tell because it's full! It's full! Okay, hold on. We'll go... Whoops! We'll put, um... We'll put down our stuff. So, check this. This is gonna be the breeding area, so where they'll go to breed. Um, and we can hopefully get some cool special chocobos. Not that, you know, all chocobos are special, but, uh... Some chocobos happen to be more special than others. Like, some chocobos can actually survive lava. How cool would that be if we could ride a chocobo into the nether and, like, float around on the lava? That'd be so cool! Okay, so let's go ahead, we'll put the straw mats in here. Hopefully that's enough for them to, uh, sleep comfortably. Um, we'll put, uh, now we need our buckets, so we can fill up our... We fill these up, or up our cauldrons. Goodness, that was hard for me to think of what to say. And now the cauldrons, actually, the chocobos drink from the cauldrons, and it helps replenish the health. So when they get, um, when they get thirsty, or they get injured, they can drink from that, and it will help heal them. The, the healing power of water! Okay, so we're gonna want to keep this closed up, though, um, so that way we don't have to ever have to struggle with trying to keep chocobos out of there. Um, oh, goodness. I'm gonna sneeze. Ah! I'm trying not to sneeze. Come on! Don't sneeze for the good guys! Yeah, okay. Um... And then one more bucket of water and our chocobo pin will be fine and then we'll go and we'll go and try and find some chocobos. But that'll probably be the next episode um, because we're kind of running out, out of time for this one. But I mean we got so much done like we haven't had a build uh, build centric episode in a while and uh, holy cow we built so much. Okay, uh, sleep. And sleep. And sleep. No? Okay. Put this here. We'll put this in here. We'll put this straw, the straw mats in there. Um, put some string seeds. Why not? some bread cool uh, I mean we that's that we really need to build a warehouse so we'll probably build a warehouse next next episode um, and then I don't know if there's a way like you know computers have like terminals so that you can access the computer at different areas and stuff I don't know if uh, if um, if there's a version of that for um, God what do you call it <laughs> for um, Ancient Warfare, or, yeah, Ancient Warfare. Okay, so we got those in there. I'm curious, I want to see if those guys... Oh, we don't, don't have a crafting table in here. We have a crafting table in here, though. So we can actually use that to create crazy amounts of bread as well. Okay, so, in here, in here, in here, 64 bread. Holy shit. <laughs> We're going to have so much bread. These guys are never going to, never, ever going to go hungry again. And it's going to be amazing. Okay, so we'll put one bread in here. We'll put one in the town hall, and we'll keep one for the road. All right, good. So, are they breaking the these the guy saw us? Come on, break the guy saw us. Break the guy saw us. Work with me. Work with me. Okay. Um, we're gonna go through. We're gonna we're gonna punch everything. All the all these that are already made, so that the the farmers may go through. There we go. And take care of the guy saw us. Apparently, they don't farm the guy saw us. Ah, oh, shucks. That's a little bit of a bummer. I was really hoping they would. That or they're just busy with other things. I don't think they farm the guy saw us. Ah, bugger. Oh well. That's okay. Um, we can... We have we have our own little guy saw farm, so we don't have to worry about that. Alright, is there anything else I want to do in this episode? Um, I think that's... I think that's it. Next episode, we'll build a chocopo... Chocobopedia. Oh, goodness, that's a mouthful if I ever heard one. A chocobopedia. Um, and we'll go searching for some chocobos, and we'll start our chocobo army. Okay, anyways, though, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was been a while, but uh, it's time to get back into it. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. You guys, keep it, you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy. Bye. <laughs>